Hi everyone, in this video, we are going to talk about collinear points. So, what does it mean by collinear points? Which means that the points lie on the same line. Let's say the points are here, we have three points, they lie on the same line and they have the same direction. So, let's do an example of a question to visualize what I'm trying to say here. So, let's say we are supposed to find the value of x in one of these coordinates here, x, for which the three points, so 0, 2 will point as point A, 1x as point B, this is point B, and C, which is 3, 1, such that A, B, and C are collinear. So, what does this mean? If they are collinear, means that they lie on the same line and they have the same direction vector. So this means that AB, the direction vector of AB equals to the direction vector of BC and this means that B is a common point. So now, let's start off and this means also that AB is a scalar. Sorry about that. So this means that from here, AB is a scalar multiple of BC. In other words, AB equals to KBC, where K is a scalar number like 1, 2, or 3. So let's start off first. So let's find AB. AB is equals to, so this our coordinate of A is 0, 2. Let's do it in column way so it's easier to visualize. So B is 1x, C is 3, 1. So AB equals to OB minus OA equals to 1x minus 0, 2 equals to 1x minus 2 whereas BC is equals to OC minus OB equals to 3, 1 minus 1x and therefore is equals to 2 1 minus x so now let's erase this part and do the math from here so now again ab equals to k b c this means that 1x minus 2 equals to k 2 1 minus x. So let's expand this. 1x minus 2 equals to 2k 1 minus x. So this, let's compare coefficients here. So by looking at the x coordinate, 1 is equals to 2k. Therefore, k is equals to half. So let's bring it here. Sorry. k1 minus x. So x minus 2 equals to k. Let's use the now. Let's use for the y coordinate here. And this. So therefore, x minus 2 equals to k1 minus x. So x minus 2 equals to half k minus x so let me erase this first to make it neater again x minus 2 equals to half k minus x so this means that okay let's expand this so 2 x minus 2 equals to sorry about that which is 
1 so 1 minus x so 2x minus 4 will give me 1 minus x so let's bring the x to one side so 3x equals to 5 therefore our x is equals to 5 over 3 so we have already found the value of x so now this means that 0 2 1 5 over 3 and 3 1 are collinear so now we have already come to the end of this lesson if you have any comments please feel free to drop me your comment and i will reply to your comment thanks so much for watching and have a nice day